Hi everybody, welcome to the channel. As you know, I'm your girl Shawi and um, guys, I'm up. As you can see that I am up and I'm also giving thanks. It's very early in the morning, around 7 o'clock or earlier. And today is one of those days that I would describe as not a very happy day it's about acknowledging how I'm feeling and because um, a lot of times society doesn't really want to acknowledge the bad parts or the sad parts of life we only focus on the happy part and the positives and all of that and at times we really don't see how people are really feeling or really thinking and emotions we only see the good parts we only see the excitement we're having fun you know on the beach shopping eating out having fun all of those stuff we tend to show those stuff and that's fine it's okay to show big stuff because people want to feel alive and other people want to you know dream a little bit and that's okay too but in all of it we try to cover the sad feeling the missing somebody that kind of thing we try to keep these things buried and covered up but why you know why why do we do that and since I've been up I've been reflecting a lot because I'm here and my family is not here and for a lot of people happiness comes through various channels for me my happiness is usually with my family and since being here I have you know it has become clearer to me that these are the things that make me happy you know back Ten years ago, I would have been so adventurous. I want to go everywhere in the world. And, you know, you want to go to big cities. You want to see places. Of course, we all have dreams. And that's all right to dream. For me, I always want to go to Switzerland. <laughs> yeah, I do. And I still do. But is this worth all? Is, it, is this worth it? Because I'm here and... As I said, today is one of those days when I'm not, I'm not feeling the happiest because I miss my family so much. I miss my boy, I miss my mother and my father and my sister. I miss them and that's the whole truth. And a lot of people would be like, oh my God, it's such a big opportunity for you to be, you know, overseas in the UK or wherever you are, you know. A lot of people may look at it and like, why, why not be happy? It's the dream. But for me, as I've said, maybe 10 years ago, I would have been feeling much elated. But at this point, I'm open, I'm reflecting, and I'm asking myself, why am I here? What's my purpose here? Because today, I don't know if it's because I'm missing my family so much today. I miss my boy. I got up and the first thing I looked at was his picture. Because <laughs> um, Susanna had sent me a picture. Because from the vlog before you see that I went to, to, to buy a pyjama for him. I said the pyjamas. And I was so shocked at his height when Susanna sent me a picture to show me how it fit him. You know, because he was excited, because he liked the Spider-Man, of course. And when I saw that picture, I'm like, this child is growing so much. And I'm not there, and I'm missing out. This is over six months, but it's a lot of time. And I'm like, oh my God, my boy is growing. He's growing, and he's well taken care of. <laughs> I know that. I'm not even doubting that one bit. But I'm not there. And you know it kind of darn on me like Am I 
if you're in the right place right now is this even the right thing is it because i'm missing him so much but that's how i'm feeling this morning we, we try to be transparent over here that's it i'm missing him i'm missing him so much i miss them so much but for the most part I think this is the way I'm getting to channel how I'm feeling because I'm here by myself the most I do the happiest I am is in the kitchen because I do stuff to make me happy I bought some plants I look forward to watering them in the morning and that's what I'm about to do now I do stuff to channel my energy but I'm also acknowledging how I'm feeling and what I'm feeling right now is a little bit of sadness. I miss my family. I miss them. And if you're watching, if you're watching Tyler, I love you. <laughs> Mommy loves you so much. Because I know he's my biggest fan. He watches all the videos. So does my mother. <laughs> she actually looks forward to watching the vlog. Yeah. It's just one of those days. So right now I'm just gonna water the plants, Lily and Rufus. So it's no longer Rufus. I saw some comments in the sec comment section saying blossom or rose or better names or more suitable names for plants and I think I like blossom blossom I will use blossom because I feel like I need to blossom somewhat so we have a blossom and we have a lily today after watering the plants I'll get ready to go to my physio appointment I have physio today and I'll see how much of that I can vlog Lily and Blossom so that's Lily and this is Blossom because it's no longer Rufus and we're going to water them so that's Blossom yeah and this is Lily Well, it's getting wet, of course. Wow. They're growing. They're looking so beautiful this morning. And that's how you know God speaks to us in nature. Because look at these beautiful plants. Hmm? Look at the flower. He definitely speaks. I'm ready now. I'm ready to go to the physiotherapist and we'll be fine. <laughs> I'm alright guys. I'll be okay. So let's go. On my way to the physiotherapist. It's just a block away. So that's not so bad. And the walking is actually good for me this morning. As you can see, the sun is shining brightly. So it's another day. It's another day to give God thanks. I'm gonna have to bend right here. Can I manage to? Ooh. Oh. oh yes so let's go guys we'll be fine we'll be fine today there are a lot of stuff to be thankful for I'm walking alone the streets are empty the only thing I can see is my own silhouette Getting stronger, step by step The clock is ticking, but there's no time for me I've been flying from town to town
now, guys, and I'm currently waiting to see the physio. So it's almost my turn. So just stay tuned. Hey, guys, I'm back from physio. I couldn't vlog much down there. I couldn't do any vlogging. So I'm actually back because it's still early in the morning. I haven't had breakfast as yet. So I'm going to try and get something to eat. I'm not sure what I'm going to prepare yet, but I will prepare something because I'm quite hungry now. And I think I need to um, rearrange some stuff because um, I didn't mention in any of my vlogs, but for the fa past few weeks, I've been staying here by myself because the roommate that I had when I just came, the flatmate, um, she had moved. She's now gone to uh another area to live and work so she's not here anymore so i'm expecting a new roommate today <laughs> a new flatmate today so i don't know at what point that person will come but i'm just gonna try and rearrange some stuff in here in the cupboards because i basically started to use everything to my own and you know i rearranged some stuff in the in the fridge as well because i'm gonna have to leave some space there for the other person when they arrive so that everything might be okay for them because you know the fridge is small already so that means say <laughs> i'm gonna cut back for some of the the buying of meat and stuff because that was one of the issues i had moving here it's like you know you have to be limited when buying like um stuff to be stored because the fridge space space is so small so the other day yes trust me i went out and i bought stuff that i could put in there i can store that i don't have to make so many trips on the road and stuff like that so yeah for a few weeks i was actually staying here by myself so that's why i felt so comfortable doing my lives and stuff like that and i was actually thinking of doing more lives but there we have it you know somebody's moving in because you know with live videos i mean people can actually move in and out and you don't want to inconvenience anybody and stuff like that because what 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 if i'm in the kitchen doing a live and then somebody comes in and you know that uh, um the building it's made in a way that um whatever you do in one room you hear it in another so usually i try to do the vlogs when i'm actually um here by myself because yes because if if i should um if I could should cough in my room, she could hear me in hers. If she flicks the switch in her room, I can actually hear it. So for that reason, I usually do my vlogs when she's not here. So, um, yes, so I was enjoying it a bit. Um, um, being, you know, alone for the couple of weeks that I was here. Um, now I'm going to get somebody else because it's the way it is. Yeah. So I have to be prepared for that next person who's going to come. So for the live videos, I guess I'll have to yeah just do it on a schedule where i know that the person is not here you know it's just that when doing vlogs i have more control over when it's not live because if i start something and somebody should interrupt then i can always dismiss it or you know and edit and all of that but with live videos it's something that's going on live you know you understand what i mean but i'm here going on and on i just need to get some breakfast all right guys stay tuned <laughs> Thank you for tuning in with us today and your girl shall we say peace out.